Alright guys, how's it going? So I was doing my usual and I was browsing the Blender Artlist forum and I seen this new add-on and I thought, ooh, that's nice. And it's called Sculpt Alpha Manager. Now this is available for free, but the developer has also put it on right click select and he asks, could you please upvote it? And that actually means if it gets enough attention it might get implemented inside a future release of Blender. So I'll put all the links in the description down below, go and grab the download, and we'll jump into Blender. Now like any other add-on, just install it like normal. Enable the add-on, and drop down the selection, and you can see here, Folder Setup Instructions. So essentially what it's asking here is, assign a folder where you keep the alpha maps. So once you've done that, quickly jump into your tool, drop down the texture, and you can see that I have two subfolders one called Fingerprints and one called Industrial. So we'll select Fingerprints, I'll click here, and it brings up the database of alpha maps. Now if you've ever used ZBrush or any kind of other sculpting tool, Mudbox, this is a must. So I can't recommend enough, please go and upvote. So I'll select something like Fingerprint 4, and I'll sign the alpha to the brush. And what I'll do here is, I'll just quickly draw in something, I'll put the radius up, and we get this effect. Now just to give you an example of the other folder, I'll jump into Industrial, I'll click here, and now I have a whole selection of alpha maps. And that's pretty much an overview of the add-on. Highly recommend, go and grab it, upvote it on right click select. Do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter because I've got no mates, you know what to do. Peace.